What's up guys, it's Sergeant Curry Pants of the YouTube Wolfpack here. I am playing Detroit Become Human and working with these awesome NGOs, the Walk Free Foundation and Freedom United, all run by the fantastic Mr. Aaron Wayne Wilson on Twitter. So thank you guys once again for all the support you've been giving these videos. It has been so awesome to make them, especially knowing that people can't wait to watch the next one, which I find pretty cool. You guys are awesome. Um, I'll be posting the links and stuff in the description if you want to hear more about the charities and stuff. They do some pretty awesome work. They raise awareness of modern day slavery, uh, child abuse, everything. It's so, so awesome. This totally reminds me of Watch Dogs. Remember how there was like the whole hacking domain in like the cargo container and you go in a lift and the crane and and then you go into this whole secret room, which is so cool. This Watch this out. girl, this this lady. She's kind of fascinating no. because she was alright with just I'll chilling in a dark room doing nothing. Like not even moving, just chilling. And then I rock up and I'm like, hey, we can steal some blue blood and spare parts. And suddenly she does a whole 180 where she looks like she wants to run the human world. Like, she went from zero to 60. She saw my lovely eyes and my charming ways. And she was just like, from doing absolutely nothing, let us do this whole political thing and, you know, show the human race how much better we are. Which is pretty fascinating. Like, you were all, lady, you were doing nothing. You were fine. You were okay. You just wanted to chill in that dark room. Not even interact with the other androids. You were just chilling. Ooh, that is slippery. But he made it work. He made that slip work. Dang. Marcus, climb up here. You know who doesn't make a slip work? Your mama. I'm so sorry. I'm just, I have the humor of a 12 year old and I know it. I have the sense of humor of a freaking 12 year old because I texted everyone in the wolf pack. I was like, hey, I heard you got leg ma. And they were like, stop, just, just stop it. Like Bare Naked Games got it a lot. Like it was just like, hey, how's your leg ma? And he's like, shut up. I swear, one day the wolf pack's just gonna kick me out. They're just gonna, they're gonna be like, Sarge, get out. It's like these guys are playing Crash Bandicoot in person. They're just jumping from platform to platform. And they're having the best time. Except for me, clearly, because I'm just slipping and making it work. They're all doing a hero stance. Look at them. Oh, I joined the hero stance. Look at my hero stance. Badass. Leave it to me. I don't understand why I'm always the one doing all the hard work. It's like going back to school and you have those group projects and I always end up doing everything because no one wants to do anything. Okay, I'd be spotted. Crap. Okay, um... What else can I do? I can go up there. Nope. Too high suddenly. You jumped something much higher just now. I, I, I'm pretty sure you did. But okay, you clearly want me to do something specific. You're not giving me free reign here. And that's fine. You want to be bossy, it's fine. Okay, now that is too high.
You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Good job, Marcus. Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. trespassing on private property. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. John! God damn machine! Where is it this time? John! I need your help. John! The drone, now this. Just my luck. You know, I'm just fascinated how her top still holds up. Because it looks like it's barely holding up. Let's finish up the oh, she's got a sleeve. My bad. My bad. We still don't have enough. That's all we can carry. Let's go. Take me with you. He's on their side. We can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring them back with us. It's too dangerous. They come with us. I know where you can find more spare parts. What do you mean? The trucks. They're full of bio components. They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Where is this key? Down there, in the control station. There are two human guards. We'll have to get the key without being noticed. This is suicide, Marcus. Our bags are full. We got what we came for. Let's go before they catch us. This is a truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. 
Wait here. If I'm not back in 10 minutes, go without me. Marcus. I'm coming with you. No, I'm going alone. It's not worth it for both of us to risk losing our lives. Goddamn dogs. What the fuck are they barking at? Could be the weather. They don't like storms. Yeah, I was gonna take my kids camping this weekend. So much for that. Is Mike still in zone four? Looks like it. And he should be done already. Better off in here than out patrolling in that. Very Assassin's Creed like. I gotta be all stealthy. Okay, okay. That was stupid. What am I supposed to do? What can I use? Okay, there's a gun. How am I gonna get that gun? Can that guy see me? Can he see? Oh, I can just. Oh, cool. Really? None of you can see me? Both of you can't see me. This doesn't have to be ugly, boys. Just leave. Just walk away. Alright, alright. Not that that would have mattered because I am actually an android, so... Frick. Although I would lose blue blood. Maybe I, that might happen. That might be a problem. Okay, okay. I had... I had like a half a second to decide what to do there. Freaking hell, there's so many buttons. I did not mean to do that. Oh man, I just, I got blood on my hands. Literally, I got blood on my hands. Did you get it? Nice. A truckload! We stole a whole truckload! We load. got bio components for everybody! We couldn't have done it without Marcus. I came to Jericho because here androids are free. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. 
Free to die in silence, waiting for a change that's never gonna come. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not gonna beg for the right to smile, or love, or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows that I am more than what they say. I am alive, and they're not gonna take that from me anymore. Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we take. We are people. We are alive. We are free. Yeah!